All right, welcome back to the Cowboy Seabop Show, everybody. Hey, did you ever hear of a company called Temu? Temu? Not sure I'm saying it right. T E M U. All right, so about a week ago, I placed an order. Okay. So far, their rating is five out of five. Welcome back to the Cowboy Seabop Show, everybody. So, is this company legit? It <laughs> looks like they are. I never heard of them. I don't know anybody that's ever ordered from them. So, I don't, I don't even know who the heck told me about them. It just fell on my lap. So, basically, I signed up. Next thing you know, I'm getting all these coupons and discounts and coupons and discounts. And what I did was I ordered two uh, Panama hats, all right, and two knives, tactical knives, neither of which have brand names, all right? We'll get into that in a second. I had a coupon. Uh, apparently, I saved like 85 dollars and my total price for two straw hats and two tactical knives was like $37 and their communication has been outstanding they sent me tracking information every day you know it's here now it's here now I mean it, it, it arrived yesterday but I was waiting till today to open it now the only thing I don't like so far is the package that it came in. especially when I got two hats in there I'm like they're gonna be crushed you know I'd expect this to be in a box so I got my gave myself a little head start I just sliced o over the one side all right so I'm not fiddling with it so let's just see how my $37 was spent. You guys know I love my hats and I love my knives. All right. One knife, two knife. All right, well, the hats seem to be in nice shape. I got me like a, like a khaki color this was like eight bucks and a black one. Again, eight bucks. Let's check out this khaki color. All right, again, no name brand. Just, they say high quality straw hat. Oh, it even comes with a string, I guess, if you wanna strap it around your uh, neck. Okay, so here is what keeps it from falling apart during shipping. That's not too bad, is it? Hey, I like this. This is gonna come in handy. I'm gonna save this. I like that. It's pretty stiff. I don't know what this paperwork is. Hold on to it. All right. Let's see. They only had two sizes, medium, large. I got the large. So. Normally, my head size is seven and three eighths. Let's see here. Hey, that's not too shabby. Panama! I like it. I like it a lot. And I also ordered a black. Panama hat. Yep, here we go. Same thing. Some paperwork, which I'll read. Here we go. Safety first. Oh, this one has the string already on it. This one has like the little connections for it. So let's check out this black one now. I normally don't do unboxing videos, but I have to do this. 
I might take this off. Then again, I might not. <laughs> we'll see. All right. So far, I'm two for two here. I really like, I just don't know why there isn't mention of any name brands. Oh, look, look. They don't say it on the website, but this is a fur talk. F-U-R-T-A-L-K. For like eight bucks. Are you kidding me? This is, it's got the hat band too on both. Also, a fur talk. Uh, I will definitely, definitely be wearing these. All right, so two for two. How about these knives, ladies and gentlemen? Here we go. With all the discounts applied, I think I paid like $15 each for these. $15, all right? Maybe less, because it was $37 with shipping. Do the math, right? <laughs> Oh, this is beautiful. Again, no name on either for now. Made in China. I got two of the same knives. One desert yellow, one black. They just call them tactical knives for camping, hunting, pairing, kitchen, uh, blade length. 3.93 inches, total length, nine and a quarter, with a four millimeter thick knife body. I'm already over the moon, guys. Kydex type sheath, all right. Nice paracord, come on. That's why I hate unboxing videos. Look at this little beauty. That there's a full tang beast, ladies and gentlemen. It's got like this hard rubber handle, they say, but it feels like plastic to me. And check this out on the sheath. You ready? It's got a built-in sharpener right there. There's a plus. All right, let's break out this uh, desert hand guys I can honestly say this is a five-star company because I'm four for four here and I do plan on ordering more now I saw like these Costa sunglasses which normally run like two three hundred dollars <laughs> they got them for like eight bucks I'm like what obviously they're covers yeah no name no name uh, 440C, I, I did see that on the website, but yeah, check it out. And they seem well, well built, well designed. I mean, you can't go wrong. And with all those coupons, you might even get them for two bucks. Again, sharpening stone on the back. All right. Yeah, these are identical knives. Yeah, four millimeter spine. Yeah, it's sharp, but not razor, razor like I like. But that's okay. We can always fix that. This has a better edge on it than the tan boy does. All right. These are gonna be fun for hikes, trails, whatever. And we'll really put it through the ringer, all right? Not too bad. I wish I could tell you an exact price, but everybody's different. Your coupon will be different. All, all it said was on the description, tactical knives, no name of actual brand, all right? Made in China. It's got a high hardness. The quenching process is supposedly spectacular they're not easy to rust they call it a rubber comfortable handle that's some hard rubber which I call plastic uh, 
I think they're nice. I really do. So anybody thinking about ordering from Tamu, and they even have contact information and returns and all that, so they seem pretty legit to me. So if this helps just one person, I did my job. All right, I'm digging it. All right, uh, let's do a once over of my four items and that's it. Guys, that's a five star company so far. All right, I am very, very impressed. It's like Christmas here at the old Seabop house. Best 37 bucks I ever spent in my life. All right, be good, everybody, and I'll see you soon. Take care.